Hello, and welcome back to a very special hated video. In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the sneak peeks for the, well, I was supposed to say upcoming, but it's not really upcoming anymore. It's already in the game, the spring or the March 2024 update. And can I just say that I don't like surprises from Hated Team? I mean, they might be good for, like, um, normal players or, you know, specifically the people that are not content creators. But for me, I mean, I'm not talking about other creators, but specifically for me, it literally killed the whole excitement, the whole enthusiasm that I get every year for the updates. It just killed everything. It killed off the vibe. I don't feel that excited anymore. Uh, to me, this feels like so messed up. And the fact that we were not given the information, and even now, I think only the super creators got the information, or maybe even they didn't get it, but we basically got nothing, and the update is already in the game. So this is something that I don't like, and I don't care, but I'm just going to say whatever I'm feeling. I, of course, love the new updates, but I don't like the fact that we have to go through this whole mess to, you know, actually enjoy the update. But anyways, um, this update is not that big, and this video is not going to be a detailed gameplay. I know the update is already in the game, and you guys might be playing it, which is good. It's really late for me, so I haven't done the gameplay. I'll obviously be showing you guys my whole gameplay later. But in this video, I'm going to show you guys some of the major things that are coming in this update. Sorry, that have already come, and those are not a lot, so let's get right into it. All right, so the first thing that's been included in this update, it's a brand new machine, and you guys know how much I love new machines. It's called as the Essential Oils Lab. We already saw this in the Dairy News, which Haiti posted two weeks ago. Now, this machine is very unique and different uh, in design because it's not your normal farm machine. It's not something that's going to make like a cooking item. I mean, I remember when the bath kiosk was added, everyone was so shocked. And this is pretty much the same machine. It's kind of vintage. It's kind of a um, laboratory type, uh, giving me a lot of astronomy feelings. Like I'm doing some sort of a crazy experiment in my chemistry class. Okay, so after running this machine for a couple of hours, it's going to get a star on it. And I must say, this looks way too beautiful when it gets fully mastered. Look at the golden color, uh, the contrast of the golden color with that little green and blue. It's very pretty. And of course, the star is prominent, which I really love about the fully mastered machines. So I'm excited to get it. And of course, I'm excited to fully master this. Now, some information about this machine. Please note it. This will unlock at level 68. It's a low-level machine. You don't have to worry about, you know, being a low-level player. It's also going to cost you just 85,000 coins, which is kind of crazy to me considering the Pasta Maker, which unlocks at level 67, it costs around 400,000 coins. So why this machine is so cheap? No idea, but I mean, you guys should be happy. It's going to take three days and seven hours, or you can spend 89 diamonds if you don't want to wait. And once you unwrap this machine, this will give you 44 XP. Now let's have a look at the products. Okay, so the first product of this machine is the Lemon Essential Oil, this cute bottle, which I really love. Very vintage, very colorful. The ingredients will be just three lemons. This will unlock at level 68, the same level at which your machine unlocks. And this will only take 10 minutes. Wow, I don't even know what to think of this. I mean, three lemons, it's not that hard, but it's also not that simple. That's a lot of lemons, and I keep about 15 of all the products. It's going to be like over 100 lemons that I'm going to use. Wow, this means you need to plant more trees. The next one is the Mint Essential Oil. Again, a very pretty bottle. Love the color. You're going to need 5 mint. This will unlock at level 85, and this will take 15 minutes. Now, that is a lot of mint. Not essentially hard to make, uh, but you're going to need a lot of crops. So make sure you plant enough of the mints. This is another great use of the mint in the game. And both of these oils will be asked in the town, in spa, and gift shop. The second major thing that's been added in this update are the ostriches in our sanctuary. I mean, who even requested them? I don't think anyone ever requested Hated to add ostriches, but I'm not complaining. They are majestic. They are stunning. They are gorgeous. So we've got two types of ostriches. We've got a gray one and we've got a pink one. Um, you are going to collect puzzle pieces for them, just like you normally collect for your Essentially Animals. 36 puzzle pieces for each, and how you can get the puzzle pieces, well, there's a many ways to get them in the game. It's going to take a lot of time, especially for me. I already have a lot of animals to unlock, so I'm not very excited about them, but I'm excited to see how do they look on Rex Farm. 
And you also get new decorations once you unlock these animals. So let's quickly check them. Here's the puzzle book look if you're interested. This image is for the pink ostrich. And this is for the gray ostrich. Guys, so the deck that you're gonna get with your gray ostrich is gonna be this um, exotic Espelatia tree, which is gonna cost you, I think, 6,000 coins. But of course, the price will increase once you buy more. And with the pink ostrich, you'll be getting this beautiful banana plant. Uh, this kind of reminds me of the banana tree, obviously, but also um, the bamboo sticks in the game. I don't know, why do I feel like the bamboos and banana plants, they have like a little connection. It's kind of funny to me. So here's a rough look at their habitat, their houses. Um, you can see the stage one at the top, the stage two, the left side, and at the bottom we have number three and number four. This will mean the future once we get the baby ostriches which is gonna be cuteness overloaded, and I literally can't wait to see it. Now, the next question is, what are you gonna feed your ostriches? Well, they will stay on your wheat bundles that you're gonna make in your farm's feed mill. It requires um, 75 wheat. All right, guys, so that was it about this video. There's actually a little more to the update, which I'll be talking about later once I do my gameplay, once I update my game. But those are the major things. I'm kind of disappointed because this update is not so big. And usually the spring updates are very big. Even if you look at the last year's spring update, that was like literally one of the biggest updates in Hades history. And I had higher expectations this year, honestly. I, you know, since they brought the dairy news feature, I was like, I loved it. But the way they treated us with information this time, you know, especially the creators, I just didn't like it. And I hope this doesn't happen in the future. I would very much appreciate it with information in advance so that, you know, we can make content for you guys and we can just bring the excitement. I know surprises are good. And I know people like surprises when you're like a normal player, but for me, I just don't. But make sure to hit the subscribe button and like this video if you enjoyed. There's gonna be a lot of other content coming as well. We have Easter Egg Maker coming. And I don't think you want to miss that information. Thank you for watching. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. What do you think of this update? Have you been enjoying it? What else would you like to see in the game? Have a good day. Bye.